This is Gavarok Fivenor welcoming you to Let's Play Monkey Hero, starting the timer now. And uh, I'm quite happy with uh, the video, it was nine minutes and a half, which is acceptable. And I'm not a giant fan of the tornadoes that don't seem to be able to die. I was just gonna try and see if they carved it, but that's a no, and... Please? Yay! This can be defeated by a smelly furball. I don't know if you could even hear me, so that's just ridiculous. But he died! Which is enough, I suppose. Just... I suppose you have the torn page. Yes, you do. This is your master, monkey. Listen carefully. The only way to defeat the Nightmare King is in his castle lair. Once the magic storybook is put back together, you should be able to enter his underworld domain. Hello, Kiko, signed into MSN. But I'm appearing offline, so he shouldn't say anything. Which is good, because if he did, then that would be interrupting the video. Okay, that's a hole in the ground. Not planning on stepping there. Now, you may notice that I am on the verge of death. I assume I should probably get that fixed by maybe going to the mushroom village and getting some, well, some mushrooms and... Wait, what the hell? Oh, God! We have to go through that bloody... Oh, Jesus. Okay, saving, saving, saving state. Please don't kill me. Broken bits of ground. Please don't kill me. I really don't want to die. Well, that song made perfect sense to an insane gopher. Oh, that was doomed to fail from the beginning. I really don't know where I'm going. This is definitely not good. That was just a fly into nowhere. As for so it should. Can I save my state here so I do not get that was dumb. Uh, okay. That was less dumb. Oh, I think I'm getting somewhere now. Or at the very least, looking like I... What? I wasn't... That was... Not complaining. Ah, there it is. I've got mushrooms. I just learned a new song. Do you want to hear it? It goes like this. Oh, Bandine. Ugh. Ow. Jesus. Oh, this is an obvious hint. Listen. I... Old Brandino is digging up a bone and tells us fond tunes leave me alone. I'm near Sage's Dojo, that's my home, and I'm going to sell this stuff to Monkey. Yeah! That doesn't make the game sound like it's treating us like complete and total idiots. But then again, I suppose people with no brains and people with no guides wouldn't know to look at that, so I don't really know why I give a crap and think it's bad, but... I'll forget it. Either way, I know where to go next, because we have 500 coins. Well, actually, we have 752, so let's go to Brandino and get ourselves some... Let's all go to Brandino, let's all go to Brandino, let's all go to Brandino and get ourselves a staff. Okay, I just, um, yeah, don't ask how that happened. Mm -hmm. Okay, I'd really rather you didn't murder me, so... Ooh, Peach. That's just peachy. Ugh. Okay, the um, god of bad puns just hit me with a lightning bolt to the brain. Okay, now the god of bad singing just did the same thing. Holy hell. Hello, tree. Did we already do that? Okay, I'm sure I already did that, but... Mm, 
That's very weird. Surely I did that. I don't know. Either way, we've got the sour peach. And we're going to go to Mar Baker next. I would have voiced the tree, but I think I already did. It's, I don't know. By the way, I'm not save stating as I make those jumps, so you can all you can all appreciate how daring that was. I also did this voice. I definitely did this voice. You can remember because of the sheer ear rape that was my exclamation of 500 coins. We have the dragon bone staff. Wow, it's even got magic coming out of its end. That was poorly worded. Uh, right. As you can see, we've got the dragon bone staff, which looks like a glorified one. Uh, we have the bracelet, we have the map, we have the scroll that doesn't seem to have a use. Oh, it's the hovering thing. We have spears, we have empty tin, which we probably won't be filling any time soon, because that would cost us money, and mushrooms are much more valuable. We have the big peach that looks like it's seen better days, which is the sour one. We have a lot of firecrackers. No mushrooms. Or a fair few dream crystals, but there's, I think there's like 20 in the game. I definitely won't be getting all of them, it'll take too long. And plus I don't know where they are, and the only good walkthroughs for this game are about two pages long. It was never really well known. We've got a book with four pages that seem to be lacking around four or five. We have the grapple, which, although useful, is as easy to use as something that's really hard to use. I'm out of acronyms. Analogies. What the hell is wrong with me? We have the hammer and we have the gourd. So, for the love of gourd, that was a bad pun. Anyway, moving on. We can now hover forever, pretty much. Let's see if we can make it across there without dying. That would be a yes, if not for the torches in the way. Let's see if we can just get slightly to the right and then go past the torches without worry. Yes, we can. We can also do really good yar bumps now, even though they have the exact same thing, but really good yar bumps anyway. Okay, so he does say it again, but he doesn't actually give us anything new. Righto, normal. That was called sarcasm. Boom, boom. Now, what are we going to be doing? Well, we are going to be running to um, this area up to the north where we found the hammer, because we're going to kill those little mushrooms with the black caps on, because they drop mushrooms a lot, and I can't really... I'm not really sure where else to get them other than that uh, maze dungeon, and that's a long way away, so we're just going to get them from here. Then after we've gotten three, we're going to use one, then we're going to get another one. Ah, uh, I wasn't planning on getting hurt as such. Um, would you mind stopping that? Oh, great. Lovely. Death. I just... I wanted that. I wanted that almost as much as I wanted that guy from... that homeless guy to come along and stab me in the gut last time I saw him, even though that didn't actually happen. I was just thinking up something I didn't want. Um... And you dropped nothing! Yay! Not happy Jan. Nothing else? No more? Oh, there's a caveman, but they're annoying. And they don't drop anything. But they probably do, but you're more likely to find a mushroom on a mushroom than on something else. At least that's my warped sense of logic, which isn't as much warped as it is quite sense-making, so... Mm. I really should learn to shut up. Don't agree, please. Okay, that was fruitless. <laughs> Maybe I should go to the maze place. I don't probably will. How far away is it, though? Forever away. Great. Well, you know my rule about suffering. You get to join me. At least until the end of this video. 
I'll probably just start off the next one having gotten the mushrooms, but you can see part of the journey here because, well, I need to fill in video time and I can't be bothered stopping then coming back to the end of this video for 50 seconds. I'm sure I've been there before and I'm sure I don't care whether I did stuff in it or not. I just want to get out of here. Do 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 do